Hello and what is up guys, Jack here from Azeku Gaming HD with a video today based on the top 10 fastest players on FIFA 13 Ultimate Team. For those of you that don't know, I go by the players base stats and not their in-game stats with full chemistry or morale. So some of these stats may be lower than you've seen in a game situation, but for example, Walcott may have 96 on his card, but in game he may have something like 98 acceleration, 97 sprint speed, so that's just an example. Also, because these players are in the top 10 in the game, there's hardly any difference between the 10th place and the 1st place. So just because they're 10th doesn't mean they're slow. I'm going to order the players by their acceleration plus their sprint speed to give you an overall speed. Plus, if that number is equal, then I'll choose whoever has the higher sprint speed because I think that's more important in basically a fast player. If that is also equal, I'll then go by the agility because I feel that makes a difference in changing direction, which is fundamental to being fast on this game. Also, there is one more thing I'd like to mention. Every player I'm about to say has the speed dribbler trait, so I'm not going to say it every time for each player, otherwise it'll get really annoying for both of us. Right, getting straight into it, in at the number 10th spot is Bravo. He has 93 acceleration and 94 sprint speed. He's very quick indeed. He also has 87 agility, great for changing direction quickly. In at the number 9 spot is, if I can pronounce it right, is Uduamadi. I'm not sure exactly how you say that, but he has 93 acceleration, 94 sprint speed. He also has higher agility, just about stealing the ninth spot with 89. One thing I would say about this guy compared to Bravo is he's a lot taller, so he'll be stronger too, which is a lot more beneficial for fast players trying to shrug off the defenders. In at the number 8 spot is Demarcus Beasley with 93 acceleration and 94 sprint speed. Again, but Beasley has 90 agility, hardly anything in it at this stage in the order. Moving into the 7th spot is Ryo Miyachi. Not only does Miyachi have the speed dribbler trait like every other player in the top 10, he also has the flare trait. Miyachi has 93 acceleration, 94 sprint speed and a massive 93 agility. Great player. I've actually used him quite a lot myself and I recommend him highly. Moving into the 6th spot now, stepping up the overall pace a bit and it is Narsing with 95 acceleration, 93 sprint speed and 83 agility. He would also make a great player in a Dutch or Eredivisie league team. Moving into the number 5 spot is Dane Richards, this time with the same overall pace as Narsing, but he has slightly higher sprint speed. He has 93 acceleration, 95 sprint speed and 82 agility. Moving into the number 4 spot is Christian Suarez with 93 acceleration, 95 sprint speed and 85 agility, but he also has the long shot taker and beat defensive line traits. Into the real fast players now at number 3 is Rojas with 95 acceleration and 96 sprint speed and 90 agility as well. So he's very very quick and agile but something I noticed about Rojas is he has 1 star weak foot and 2 star skill which has got to be the worst stats I've seen in terms of that area. He also has really low stats in all other parts of his uh, technical ability. Moving up to the number 2 spot is Bibiani, who some of you might say is quicker because he has 97 sprint speed compared to the number 1 who has 96, but here are his stats anyway. He has 95 acceleration, 97 sprint speed and 85 agility. He also has the tries to beat defensive line trait. Moving into the number 1 spot, the fastest player in all of FIFA 13 statistically is Theo Walcott, yes you guessed it right. He has 97 acceleration and 96 sprint speed, so he has an overall higher speed or pace. He also has 81 agility, so Bibiani and Walcott are very close indeed. Not much in it at all, but as I said, with the in-game chemistry and morale boost, these players get even quicker. So that's the end of this episode of Top 10. Hope you enjoyed it and found it interesting. I definitely did. Remember to comment on what other attributes you would like me to do in the next video, but make sure you check out my other episodes i done which you can find in the series playlist which you should find on screen now so that you know which ones I've already covered. Please remember to like the video as well and possibly favourite if you like this episode and this kind of series and until next time I will catch you later. Bye. As well. He also has a speed dribbler trait which is perfect for this team. Moving up to the left wing position you probably guessed it already is Neymar the young 5 star skilled talent from Santos.